Korea was out scouring the mountains of the Western Cape, collecting specimens of another pea species, Indigofero, for his PhD, when he discovered a plant species believed to be extinct. The only collection of this species was made in 1804, which is about 215 years ago. Um, made here in the Tilbach area, uh, but without a precise location. It's one of the first recorded species to have been lost to forestry in the Western Cape in the late 1700s. A type of fountain bush from the pea family that used to grow next to the mountain streams in the Tulbach region. Conditions need to be just right for these pea species to bloom. The species was probably lying dormant for quite a while before the most recent fire um, and will probably die back down and seed will be laying in the seed bag until the next fire comes around. Cape flora is especially difficult to discover, as most species are restricted to a really small patch and it's easy to miss them if you don't go off the beaten path. It's just a simple fact that a lot of the Cape species are extreme habitat specialists and only uh, occur in very small areas. So if you don't go through a very specific area, you'll probably just miss the species. One of the unique and distinguishing characteristics of its flowers, a beautiful hue of purple hanging at the end of a very delicate but springy flower stem. And once we learn more of what these plants actually do in, the, in nature, um, whether they have specific interactions with uh, insects or something that we don't even know of yet, um, and if this plant was to disappear, all those uh, some symbiotic relationships that it would have with other living organisms uh, might also f fall away and those species would also be lost. The discovery of the small, easily overlooked small plant species gives hope to many more discoveries. Linky Birman, SABC News, Winterschuk Mountains.